Today, I'm going to try to take over the whole map in Medieval RTS. This may sound like a difficult and precarious task, but do not worry because I shall be using my brain. Anyways, I decide to start things off by looking at possible candidates for an alliance. Okay, uh, rounds just started. We have every, every, all the teams over there. I need to team up with Miniature Boy, which is green and uh, also orange, but uh, it's too late for that. What do you mean by that? Let's get a few builders up and running. I need to, I need to farm resources as fast as possible here. Maybe I can attack orange if I speed things up really fast. Maybe possibly green. Windmill here, windmill there, and one last one here. All right. Well, this is a good start. I need a steady source of income before I start attacking orange over there. I don't know, he's not really doing much. Green all the windmills. Get some builders over here. I'm going to focus on building a cash economy, which is basically build as much shit as possible without angering other people. You know, I could play this smart and build a defense. What's that? What's that? But honestly, everyone's too weak right now to actually attack me. So yeah, if I build a barracks real quick, I should be good. I might be crossing some people's territory by building another windmill so far out from my base, but screw it, I'm doing it. Cash is cash. I only have two swordsmen ready to protect this whole place. So yeah, let's get this on lockdown. Ooh, wait a second. I have a genius idea. Let's build a whole bunch of towers here and just block this whole entrance to prevent red from coming in. Let's get another builder too. This builder can go ahead and go all the way over here. I'll build basically the Great Wall of China. What is Oscar doing? He's just... He's not doing anything. He's just sitting on his castle. Another tower, and uh, we shall continue the build. Okay, so I think it's time now to do a siege workshop. I'm eventually going to attack Oscar, because I don't like him. And yeah, that's basically it. Wait, actually, let's go ahead and build another windmill right next to Oscar's base. If he attacks it, it's a provocation of war, and shall be uh, treated as such. No, sir, that's yeah. not a good, yes, idea. It's a good idea. I low-key want him to attack it. Okay, let's get some knights under our belt. You know, this is pretty... I've been pretty efficient so far. It's kind of weird. Not normally this efficient. Three hours later. Okay, upgrade everything. I'm now making 137 per turn. This is really good. Stupidly good. I don't really have any reinforcements to give to Green at the moment, so I wish him luck. <laughs> Look at Oscar just staring at me. <laughs> clueless. Yeah, let's not say clueless because he could have, he could just be plain dumb and ultimately destroy my whole base. Let's try to get a catapult. Uh, oh crap, I need to build houses. I don't have any storage for all this. Mm, let's put all of our houses right here. Yeah, looking good. Did Oscar leave? I think Oscar left. Oh, crap. He's been replaced by a military general. That's so funny. Oh, he left too. Can I send a builder over there and maybe take... Oh, no. Oscar's back. What is he doing? Siege workshop. Let's get our first uh, trebuchet or catapult. Let's be smart about this. Trebuchet does so much more damage. And it has way bigger range. I'll do a trebuchet. Screw it. Trebuchet is in the works now. And uh, yeah. So far, invasion plan on Oscar is a go. My teammate, though, is kind of... I don't know what he's doing. Trebuchet on the way. Let's get a few, a few swords. In. Yeah, why not? Now, can I? Oh, crap. He's building an army. Never part of the plan. Shit. <laughs> uh, yeah, no. Oscar's kind of mad at me right now. I don't know, bro. I need to build. I need to build more. What can I build? A watchtower. Oh, building limit. Where's, 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 where's? Builder hut. Come on, come on. Build him, build him, build him. Get my swordsman over here to the front. Honestly, he could attack me right now and I completely destroy him, but I don't really want to risk losing that yet. Okay, so we are basically building a circle around Oscar. And yeah, that's the whole plan. We're just going to circle around him until he fails. Dies. Uh, like that's a good plan. It's a perfect plan. Oh, we are we reached the unit limit. That's unfortunate. I'm putting all my houses in a neat single file line just in case Oscar decides to attack me. You know, Green's not really doing much right now. He's just he's just chilling, bro. He's just chilling. Okay, troop limit is way higher now. And uh honestly, I could get another trebuchet. Screw it. I have the money. If I was Oscar right now, I'd be scared. Like another trebuchet coming his way. Imagine when I get the wizards down. And things are gonna get crazy. One, two wizards. Two wizards coming up. Okay, here are my good troops. Oh, is it time? to attack Oscar. I don't know. I think it might be time. No. <laughs> Hopefully that scared him a little. I'm gonna start the attack now. Look at my teammate. He's probably shocked by how many troops I have. And to think that I only started playing this game like 45 minutes ago. Well, I'm now holding a siege. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. I gotta do it to you. Oh, God. It's kind of a massacre. He's new in this game? Well, uh, life ain't fair. <laughs> I still have PTSD from the other match where I got completely annihilated. Okay, so my base is on an isolated island, which means that I have not that many problems to deal with. I It's pretty easy to defend 
Oh my god, I'm already getting attacked. What the hell? I just started the game two seconds ago. It can't possibly get any worse. No, no. Okay, well, I mean, there's really nothing I can do here. Look, you may question my strategies. They may be unethical and they may look harsh, but it is what it is. I'm sorry, Oscar. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. The game's the game. <laughs> okay, last guy. I actually feel kind of bad for beating him like this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm gonna pretend I don't see his messages. <laughs> no. <laughs> No, oh, this was funny. I'm not gonna lie. Now we start the building process. Uh, don't feel too bad here, man. Because guess what? You get to build more windmills for money. Yeah, better economy. Well, that's the end of Oscar, guys. That is the end of Oscar. Hey, look, guys, on the positive side, I now have a really good source of income. I'm now making 170 per minute. And the other kingdoms over here are probably plotting against me because they've seen how much power I have. What can I make? What can I make? I could do a hospital or an armory. The only thing from the armory that actually I actually want is far crossbows. That's the only thing that's really good. Also, I could probably, I should probably build a hospital. Need y'all to heal up real quick. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and try to help out Green by uh, destroying this other base over here. All right, destroy, destroy the freaking red tower. I don't. This thing doesn't even do any damage to troops. Actually sad. You know what? I'm feeling kind of generous. I'm gonna help out Green. I'm sending him a, a few a few V-Bucks. A few V-Bucks. I can upgrade these even further? What? I didn't know that was a thing. Now what I gotta do is build more builder huts. Because they're really, 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 really important. I have too many builder huts. God damn it. Why does everything have to be so difficult? How do I get more? <laughs> I need more builder huts. Oh wait, actually, I could just upgrade my castle. And it increases my money. I'll get even more money than what I'm getting right now. Bro, what is the... What, dude, build two layers of walls here. I do hope he knows that I can just use trebuchets to destroy all that. Let's see, who can we attack here first? We should probably get rid of purple. They're the biggest threat. <laughs> I accidentally said that in lobby chat instead of team chat. Whoops. Well, now purple knows I'm out to get him. Oh god, we are destroying his base right now. I don't know if he pushed in too far though. We might have, but I mean, we're not doing too bad right now. Okay, so uh, we did not in fact win that attack. I lost most of my troops, but um, we destroyed all of his walls and also some of his freaking economy type stuff not bad not bad at all total success i will however restock on troops get more knights and not really a whole lot of wizards i don't like the wizards now actually oh wait a second red is attacking orange is also building a huge army i may have just overplayed this if orange does decide to attack me on this side i'll have a small little group of crossbow people to defend the time for the battle approaches okay we are launching our attack i repeat we are launching the attack <laughs> No! Oh god. No! <laughs> I just got wrecked. What the hell? Uh, well, I lost all my base. My whole base. Of course you did. Dude, Orange played that perfectly well. You know what? Props to him. Props to him, bro. I'm gonna send a green all my cash because I can't really build anything. Wait a second. I still have a mage. Wait a second. I still have troops. Is he trying to attack Orange? Yes. He's trying to attack Orange. Avenge me. Come on, green. You got this. You can do it. I believe in you. I believe in you. Oh, God. Green just got demolished. Green just got demolished. <laughs> oh, that was funny. Well, what did I learn here today? Maybe build double walls if you're defending. Maybe build a bigger army if you are going to attack people and cover your flanks. Hmm. 